Here we have 2013 relative velocity, question 2a, we've got this diagram with a travelling in this direction along the y-axis and b travelling down in this direction with an angle theta. Car a is moving with a speed of 9, b is travelling quicker, speed of 15 and at a certain instant each car is 90. So b is going to get to the intersection first, distance divided by speed, he's going to get there in 6 seconds. A is going to go 9 by 6, 54 meters in this time. So A is going to be 90 minus 54, which is 36 meters from the intersection. And that's the first part here find the distance between the cars when B is at the intersection. So that will give us our diagram. We have A 36 meters from B. 36 meters and when usually in part 2 we're told if the shortest distance is this 36 it's not usually this 36 but if it is this 36 find the value of theta so something quite specific happens in this question so let's look at the velocities let's look at the velocity of a it's equal to 9 in the i direction 9i plus 0 in the j the velocity of b is equal to 15 cos theta in the i direction that's going into the positive negative sector so it's going to be minus 15 sine theta in the j direction and the velocity of a relative to b to b relative to a either the velocity of a relative to b is going to be velocity of a minus the velocity of b 9 minus 15 cos theta in the i direction plus it's going to be minus minus so plus 15 sine theta in the j direction and if this 36 meters is the shortest distance b is coming down like this velocity of b down this direction this is the velocity of a is going in this direction so the velocity of a relative to b if this is the shortest distance will have to be one of the straight sides therefore we'll have to form a right angle with the velocity of b usually the shortest distance is over here we're given the hypotenuse in these questions so quite an unusual one here so for this to be true if this is the velocity of a relative to b and they form a right angle it means that the slope is equal to zero or the tan of the angle so 15 sine theta over 9 minus 15 cos theta this is equal to zero we would have to have 9 minus 15 cos theta equal to zero that's it 9 minus 15 cos theta equals zero so cos theta is going to be equal to 9 over 15 giving theta a value of 53.13 degrees